Hello everyone, this is Vrishali and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In previous session, we discussed about HTTP, HTTPS, then POP, IMAP and FTP application layer protocols with examples. I have mentioned a complete computer network subject playlist link in below description box. Now, in today's session, we will discuss the next topic that is SMTP and MIME application layer protocol. Let's start the session. At the end of the session, you should learn about SMTP protocol with working and examples, then MIME protocol with working and examples. At the end, we discuss difference between that and the important question bank. Now, the first point is what exactly SMTP protocol. Here, SMTP stands for Simple Mail Transfer Protocol. This protocol generally used in Gmail application. See here in this particular image, there is a sender and on the other side there is a receiver. Sender want to send particular mail to the receiver by using internet or Gmail application. So for sending email purpose, SMTP protocol is used. This protocol is based on the client-server model. Receiver receive those protocol. At that time, IMAP and POP protocol is used. We already discussed this protocol in previous session. I have mentioned the link of that video in below description box. These protocols are generally used to access a particular mail by using multiple device. Means, receiver receive a particular email account by using laptop as well as mobile or as well as another computer device. So, IMAP POP protocol provide multiple device access. Now, the next point is working of SMTP protocol. The first step is client initiates the request. See here, suppose this is a sender and this is a receiver. Sender want to send particular mail to the receiver. The mail id of receiver is myreceiver at the rate gmail.com and the mail id of sender is abc at the rate gmail.com. Now, this sender want to send mail by using gmail by using particular internet, right? So, sender click on the send button. So, at that time, this Gmail connect to the Gmail SMTP server. And this server is used port number 587. So, now the second step is SMTP server authentication. Before sending email, Gmail SMTP server validate the username and password of the client. Because only authorized users can send email through the server. So they check client username that is abc at the rate gmail.com. This is a valid username and also the particular authentication. So this is the second step. Next. Now, after Gmail authentication, this sending email send all the email contents, means subject of the email, uh, the complete message as per the email and this uh, particular message sent to the Gmail server to the SMTP server. Now the next step is sending emails. So here SMTP server forward this mail to the recipient mail server. So recipient mail server they use some commands to identify a particular mail. For example they check a subject from means client mail id to means sender receiver mail id then date time and also actual message that sent by the sender. So for that purpose, they use different commands like mail from this command specifies sender mail address, receipt to this command specifies recipient mail address, then data means start of the message body and quit means close the connection. So receiver receive the complete mail ID. Now after that, SMTP server sends email. So once the email content successfully sent to the recipient mail server, the particular message display in inbox of the receiver. Now receiver access those mail by using their Gmail account, their login and by using IMAP POP3 protocol. Means by using that protocol, they access a particular mail by using mobile as well as laptop. They provide the multiple device access. So this is the working of SMTP protocol. Now the next protocol is MIME protocol. MIME stands for Multipurpose Internet Mail Extension Protocol. See, SMTP protocol is a basic one. They send a particular email through text information only. But now, uh, this MIME is an email extension protocol. Means they have the capability 
to send images audio video towards to the receiver they provide the advanced features towards the smtp protocol now the next is what is the need of mime protocol the first point mime support multiple languages in email this supports hindi french japanese all the languages in particular email and there is a no word limit you can send email as many as a particular content next mime protocol also allow users to exchange various types of digital content means you mail different pictures audios videos to the other device this supports various types of documents like uh, jpg png pdf words so these are the main advantage of mime protocol now there are many types of emails they use html and css programming language for coding purpose and this mail used for marketing purpose there are different images are there there are different videos are there for marketing purpose so at that time also mime protocol is used now let's see the working now the first step is creating the email with multiple content type just take a example suppose there is a employee and there is a manager employee want to send monthly report of company to the manager now this monthly report of company is in pdf format first thing second this report also included the logo of that company right means there is a image is attached right and all the information are stored in text format means multiple contents are there so that's why mime protocol is used now this all things are sender compose in email and send towards the mime server now the next step is encoding the content in mime format see here client attach different types of data like pdf images text right now mime has best 64 encoding technique this best 64 encoding technique convert your pdf html images in text format that's why it is a binary to text encoding scheme they convert all the data in text format in ascii string format and this data is sent towards the receiver and receiver decode it so this is the second step first step compose email with different content second step to encode data convert data into the text format also mime protocol divide the data as per the features they divide pdf in one side they divide images of particular mail they divide text information into the mail and uh, all the information have stored one parts in that next is begin so first compose second encoding now the third is transmitting the emails so after encoded mime protocol send a particular mail a uh, particular mail to the smtp server see mime just encode the data but it is sending and receiving done by the smtp server now this smtp server delivered this mail to the receiver mail server now on the receiver side receiver receive those mail id right and decode those mail id in particular html pdf and image format so encoding and decoding this operations have provided by the mime protocol now let's see the difference of smtp versus mime smtp send emails between the servers MIME protocol extends some email functionality they attach some uh, images pdf and different multimedias smtp handle only plain text message but now it supports all the digital data smtp does not supports encoding but mime supports encoding by using best 64 technique smtp commonly used when there is a basic emails there is a text information have sent but mime protocol used when there is a digital data there are images pdf word file jpg videos audios are there so at that time mime protocol is used now smtp protocol is responsible for email delivery but mime protocol is just used for to formatting the emails and this email delivered by smtp smtp protocol example is they send plain text email between email servers but mime protocol send marketing emails where digital data have added towards the receiver so this is the basic difference between that now as per your exam point of view the first question 
write a short note on SMTP MIME. This is one of the most important question. You have to explain uh, their definitions, workings with example. And the next question is explain MIME header with particular page containing emails for six marks. So this is all about. Thank you. Keep learning.